pop on in. We're going to get your shoot on now. Cool. Okay, go ahead, put your arm back around there. Put your arm around here. Pete Sanchez gets his first feel for a T-34 trainer. The University of South Florida senior will report for training in Pensacola this fall. His recruiter recommended the ACE program so he could get one last look before September. I was afraid because I really didn't know what to expect, you know. Now I see what, what's going to be expected of me, so I'm a little more at ease. Sanchez is in the third class of students going through the program. So far, eight students were not physically qualified, and six students changed their mind. It's not to, uh, to go after them early and try to scare them uh, away from our program. We just want to give them an honest view of what it is, what that expectation will be. How far down this line is M going to be? Brian Hartman is now in his seventh week of officer candidate school. He was one of the first ones to go through the ACE program. Some of the people who uh, came before me through officer candidate school who didn't have a chance to go through the ACE program were a bit envious of the fact that we got to go see the way things work and, and get to go fly as well. Sanchez says he'll spend the summer trying to get in shape, but he'll definitely be back. I think they're impressed with the Navy, impressed with the way we do business, impressed how we train. And uh, if they're looking for that kind of adventure and excitement, and the thrill and the challenge more than anything else, I think we can sell them Navy.